You know, I I want up. Uh, okay, they knew what I was doing. No, no, <laughs> they figured me out before I could even try to do it. That'd be funny if I can actually snipe one of these. Oh wait, 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 wait. Maybe, maybe, maybe. No, nope. I am a terrible person. <laughs> anyway, so we'll come back to some more Shadow of the Colossus. Where last time we took down the big old Shadow Gecko Kuromori. Which is one of my favorite colossi. I really love that fight. I think he's a really interesting boss. And this time, we are heading after our ninth colossus. Almost to the double digits. Which is kind of scary because that means there's there's less than ten colossi left. Oh god. <laughs> yeah. So, this guy is not that yeah. far away. Yeah. This guy's actually pretty yeah. easy to go yeah. and find. Yeah. Remember that giant yeah. dark cloud that we've been seeing at, since the very beginning of the game? That's where he is. So yeah, we're going into the dust cloud itself. And this guy is really cool. He's annoying. I will warn you that. He is kind of annoying to deal with. You'll see why whenever we fight him. And, I mean, he's not my least favorite Colossus because of that. He's definitely not my least favorite. I think he's really, really cool. <sighs> I have a lot of grievances with uh, Hydrus, needless to say. Because, uh, for those who for some reason watch the first LP of this channel, you know what exactly I'm talking about. I had so many issues just trying to fight that guy, added on top of the technical issues that I had with fighting that guy, so needless to say, I did not have a capture card and I relied heavily on pressing share on the PlayStation 4 controller and editing everything in Share Factory. For those who have no idea what the hell I'm talking about, imagine trying to edit a video with a controller. Yeah, it's not great. <laughs> but I did say we were coming back over here to go and take care of the shrine, and, well, this is that time. I just wanted to save it for later because I figured it was better to take care of this here than before we went after Hydrus. So, I don't remember who it was that I was going after for that, but yeah, no. It was Hydrus. Prayer. Man, we have a lot more health now. So, where are you, Mr. Lizard? I hope you're not going to be a bitch today. Because you usually are. The camera always wants to swing back around and aggro. I really don't want you following me right now. Because she likes to scare the... Oh, hey, buddy. Hey, hey, hey. Boink. I think that took off your tail. Well, that certainly did. That murdered you, most likely. All right, that worked out pretty good. So just climb up here. And eat the tail. Yoink. Still haven't found any of those fruit. There are specific fruit in the game that you can find that will increase your health, but honestly, it is completely pointless. You don't need that much health in the game. It's very, very uh, lenient on the amount of health that you lose in this game. I mean, I digress. But that's aggro. Um, There we go. I was trying to do that, and aggro is just trying to get me yeah. killed. Yeah. So we want to go on over to the right over here, but yeah, the lake bed is what we are going after for. So, pretty cool. Like I said, I love the design of this boss, but the boss itself is annoying. <laughs> it's very cinematic, don't get me wrong. It's a very cinematic fight. It's just, God, it's annoying. Um, I think, did I take care of this shrine here? Yeah, I did. Oh. So I could have skipped that entire rigmarole of going through, through that route all the way. I feel stupid. All right. Uh, I guess, in hindsight... That's what I thought it. I had to do, I guess. I don't know. Most long, drawn-out way to get over to a boss, I swear to God. Hey, at least this guy's pretty close by, so... Uh, whoa, hey, 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 I think I gotta go over to the right here. Like I said, I was going to do... Um... Oh. Is that, I thought I had to do that. Um... Oh, it's over to the left. Okay, I thought wrong. Okay, aggro, I swear to God. Most unwieldy ass horse. Like, here's the thing: they had two entire remakes to fix her, and they didn't. <laughs> like, what is that floating in the distance there? Wait, what is that actually? Um, can I can I see what that is? That just made it zoom out. Oh, it's a tree. Oh, <laughs> it just didn't render the the tree stump or tree stump. What the hell am I saying? It didn't render in the, the actual tree. Okay, is this where I got it? Oh, that's the bridge right there. I'm looking right at it. Derp. I am not a smart person. I have never claimed to be. <laughs> so, 
so, uh, anyways, now we're over here in this giant, well, lake bed, and we want to head on down here. Uh, yeah, into this giant cave, which, dear God, that would be horrifying to actually find. I digress. Start heading into here. Get ready for one of the coolest designed bosses ever. Meet Basaran, also known to the developers as Kame, or Tortoise, Simple Turtle. <laughs> so this is one of the other colossi that can actually shoot crap at you. He has ranged attacks and he is very deadly. What we want to do is see these geysers out in the field. We oh my god, he's already shooting him. We want to lure his ass on over to these geysers. Uh, where? Oh, you. He is very fast, by the way. Oh god, he's angry. He is angry. Aggro, aggro, aggro. We're fine. So yeah, you kind of want to hover around the geyser if you can. He doesn't do a ton of damage, but it can stack up, especially if he's taking his sweet little time. There we go. All right, turn, 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 turn. Aggro, what the hell are you doing? Ow! Oh, my horse. Okay, this might be a good spot. Cause yep. Okay, it's happening. He'll eventually start getting lifted up by the geyser. And kind of like Quadratus, he has stuff underneath his little hooves. So we want to shoot that with our arrows, if I can get that. Oh, that was perfect. Wow. And then he'll topple over like the giant turtle that he is. Kaboom. Yeah. Super cool. And we get this theme back. So, now we just got to run on over to his side here. Hopefully I don't get crushed. Yeah. You can get crushed in this game, and it is a one-shot kill. All right, here we go. On to his belly. His big old belly. Yeah, this guy's usually not that bad, but he can be annoying to try to get over to the geysers. Good thing, though, if you shoot the underneath of the hoof, that is gone completely. You don't have to do that again if you have to redo the geyser bit. So, jump up there before he flips on back over. There we go. Perfect. Now we just wait for him to get back up, which shouldn't be too bad. Wee. And unlike Quadratus, he does not have a butt sigil, so... Oh, God. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Th oh, no, that's not fine. Are you kidding me? In hindsight, I probably should have uh, done something different with that, but yeah. Okay. Well, at least I can demonstrate that you don't have to do the whole shoot his hoof thing again. All right. Let's go over here. Because I do see a guy's... Actually, there's one right beside me. What am I doing? Okay. Quadra er, well, I was about to say Quadratus. Basaran, where are you? Oh, he's over there. Buddy. Uh, buddy, where are you going? Uh, I'm very confused. I literally can't see him. Buddy, get over here. There, I think I pissed him off. Yeah, I did. Okay. Man, that was stupid. I, that, that should not have turned out that way. Oh, God. Run, 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 run. Uh, okay. Turn. Turning radius on this horse is really bad. Okay, turn him over here. Turn him over here. Come on. These guys are like to turn off, so... Oh, no, that's going to be bad. No, I did not want you to stop. Okay. Turn. Jesus, aggro. Okay, go over here. Go over here. Buddy, 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 buddy. Oh, pal. Oh, buddy. I need you to get hit by this geyser when it goes out. Well, he's kind of on top of it. He has to be, like, directly on it. All right, I'm going to jump off here because that should be going up. Yep, it is. Um, oh, he's going on the other side. Yeah. You have to do it for the other side if he starts tilting from that other end. So hopefully I can get there in time. All right. Shoot that. Uh, shoot that. Shoot that. Shoot that. Please. Oh, come on. At <laughs> Wander. I'm aiming right at it. What is happening? Oh, my God. Okay. Hit it. Jesus. I think I hit it. No, I didn't. What was that bull? Okay. I'm just gonna... Oh, God. He's gonna slam. He's gonna slam. Go, 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 go. This is supposed to be a really short fight. That is not supposed to happen. Ugh. Okay. Also, uh... Is he gonna start tilting again? Because if I can get him onto the geyser again, that'd be perfect. Oh, my God. And he threw me off with a horse. Get on, aggro. This is just going really swimmingly. <laughs> he is not doing the crap I need him to do. Wander just decided to not hit his hoof whatsoever. Uh, 
He should be tilting from that, but I don't know why he's not. Okay, buddy, head over here. Turn! Oh my god, now I have to wait for the geyser again, but hey, at least I'm on the side here, so that works out pretty good. Uh, he shouldn't be able to hit me as long as I'm circling around, and he's doing that attack, so... That shouldn't hit me! Well, if aggro keeps walking towards it, it's gonna hit me. Jesus. Okay. Should be going off soon. Please. Is that not close? Are you kidding me? Bossaron, what are you doing, pal? Alright, walk over here. That should lift him up. There we go. Okay. Oh, maybe you do have to hit him again. Er, nope, nope, nope. That's not the case. That is good. Okay. Attempt number two without falling off of this freaking stupid Colossus. Jesus. I don't even know how I fell. I mean, I knew how I fell off. I should have just stayed on the section I was at. Uh, and again, hopefully I don't get crushed by his giant turtleness. I'm just going to go around for safety. Yeah, this guy is massive. And he weigh, probably weighs a ton. All right. Attempt number two. Thankfully, he only has one sigil, so it's not that bad. But still, that is really annoying. Just climb up normally. I got up there way too quickly, so that's probably the part of the reason why I got thrown off. So, all right, come on. Get all the way up there, Wander. It should be all right. All right, climb up. All right, I am staying here. I don't care how much grip I have, I am staying here until you are done, sir. Because last time you threw me off. There we go. Okay. You gonna do your shimmy shimmies? No, you're not. Okay. Go to his back and back here. Uh, really, Wander? How'd you even trip? Yeah, he has a little back canyon back over here, which is pretty cool. This should give us pretty good protection. Oh, gross. All right. Whoa, hey, that was cool physics. Ooh. Yeah, you're, you're going to trip a lot on this guy, but it's fine. And we reach his head. Thank God. I hope I have a plant here. Kind of looks like I have one, actually. Uh, no, no, I don't. Okay. That was just me coping. All right. And no. He does like to shake a lot, and that's purely RNG, so can't do nothing about that but to do the right timing. All right. Get you another few stabs in. But yeah, boss around's pretty cool. I mean, he's pretty simple. Uh, the geyser thing is annoying, but besides that, he's a really easy Colossus, and he's close by. It should not have taken me almost 15 minutes to go and kill this guy. It should have been like five, but whatever. It's fine. At least I got to show this guy off more, so. But, oh god. Well, I was gonna say that was your end, but you started shaking, and, well, apparently Wander can't handle a shake or two. You're done for, buddy. Good night. There he goes. Big old turtle is down. I think he's one of the last few... Uh, no, that's not true. He's definitely one of the last giant colossus that are quadrupedal, I'm pretty sure. Thy next foe is an isolated sand dune. Its tracks are well hidden. Shaking the earth, its gaze is upon thee. Well, that just reminded me of a boss that I'm really terrible at. 
And look at Wander. He's looking even worse for wear. Like, look at his legs, man. <sighs> Makes me feel fat bad for him because the further you go into the game, the more rugged he becomes. Um, besides all the stuff I've already said about Bossaron, there is a speedrunner tech where you can fly off of aggro onto his back leg and actually climb up, kind of like Phaedra, but it's in a very, it's a very specific and particular trick that is very difficult to pull off. So, hey, if you're good at it, might as well take advantage and not have to deal with the geysers, right? But anyways. That is where I'm going to end things off for right now. So, next time on Shadow of the Colossus, we'll be going after our first double digit, number 10. I will see you guys in the next one. Take care.